Get ready to laugh, cringe, and shake your head as we count down the top moments of Entitled Karens bringing chaos to your week. This Karen was being impatient at the drive-thru and kept honking like crazy. The person in line decides to record her wild behavior, and when she sees it, she totally loses it, starts screaming and honking at it. No, we're not serving her. Uh, you're not. Your order is not being taken. Hey! Hey! They just told me they're not going to serve her. Hey, they just told me they're not going to serve her. So you probably want to back up. They just told me they're not going to serve you. So I'd go somewhere. Because he's on my side. I'd go somewhere else if I were you. Chill out. Just chill out. What's going on, man? She's crazy. I know. I'm working on door dashing, bro. Yeah. I feel you. Yeah, there's. Oh, well. They're just sitting right there, man. I'm just not perfect. They're not going to order for her. They're not gonna let her order. Let them say that. They just told me that. I did. He's gonna hit me. She almost hit my car. Yeah, it's coming right now. One moment, okay? I'm okay. Sorry. This entitled Karen gets all mad and starts screaming at this guy, accusing him of stealing her parking spot. But the guy kept his cool and handled Karen like a total pro. Uh, I'm I here, ma'am. You, ma you are I don't the biggest, your... ma'am. You're whatever this is is the biggest loser. I am. Loser. You are right. You are a loser, my yes, friend. Yes, ma'am. Loser. Yes, ma'am. Only a loser does that. This I... is. He has no honor, no ethic. None at all. You should both be ashamed of yourself. We... You for hanging out with a loser, and you for being a deadbeat loser. Yes. I am taking a picture of your driver's license. Okay. Of your license plate. Perfect. Be ready. Yeah, perfect, because you're a loser. I could tell how comfortable you are with stealing a spot. Yes, ma'am. I, I hope you have a great day. It smells like garbage. You're all I, I hope you have a great day. I will. I will Good. I didn't do the wrong thing. Oh, I mean, I have no shame, so I feel fine about it, too. I, I have plenty of money. I can go ballot. Oh, then I would have done that already. <laughs> I'm poor. I need this spot. <laughs> This guy gets a change for his order, but when a penny drops on the ground, the worker asks him to pick it up. Well, he gets all mad, starts arguing while the worker is throwing attitude like there's no tomorrow. I'm at this McDonald's and um, I just give him, gave him a 10. He just dropped all the change on the floor. So he's telling me to pick it up and I said, no, I'm not going to pick it up. And I asked him to give me my $10 back, and now he said no. And he's just serving people in front of me. See? He's serving people in front of me, and he's refusing to give me my change back. And they are in there laughing. I'm just, I'm just asking me to get, to give what me my, I'm just, he, he, he dropped it. I don't know How what. How much did he drop? I just need my $10 back. So, I'm just asking my, I was asking for my money back. You want everything back? I just want my money back, that's okay. it. So that's what I was asking. So I don't know why he was doing that. You want to do that because you're crying about I'm you. not I crying. Know. I'm not crying. And I'm not your bro. And I'm not your buddy. No, I'm not. You yeah. can't face you. Get the yeah. I'm not going to use any curse word toward you. I'm a professional. I'm a professional. You're crying over a I'm not crying. I'm being professional. Man, come in the and quiet. Please, can you move? Because there's cars behind you. That's how, that's how you're supposed to be talking. I'll, I'll deal with it. You got your don't, money Don't back. start yelling at so, me. So please move because I need to take care of those. How will you be moving? This lady was having a total meltdown in the store, screaming about her past. It turned into a total circus and a real show for the other customers. And my grandma.
grandma said, Esther Ruth Powell, then I would take care of the rest. That's what she need. Amy Hunter, daughter. That was your $2 for the scratch off and the pen I took. And I told her, that. I said, I need it. I don't have the money on me right now. And I came back the next day and I gave it to her. Run in town. Three year old for that hip hop shit. For the hip hop? Yeah, no, for hooky boy. And bands. If they're trying to play a game. Not for hip hop. Oh, so, oh, the internet shit. Oh, there with the computer love. That shit don't bother me. Show the world. And that wrong for real. Everybody. It is real. Now I've been in basements. Yeah, everybody needs to hear this. Excuse me? No, everybody needs to hear it. You're right. No, 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 no. Everybody don't need that gate of two dollars right there. there oh, okay. Go. It's 220. Yeah, whatever it takes. No. No, it would be right here. Ain't putting no broom in me. Yeah. And down in Mexico. So you can see what I can say about my mom. And my dad was in prison. With the boss, Rose. And Lynette. Yeah, I'm La Rooster. Yeah, and it's all speaking Spanish over me. I mean a three-year-old. Yeah, that's speaking Spanish over me. So let's get it popping so I can get on. Hurry up, ma'am, so I can get on. Now don't give a it is. That will go two dollars. I don't give a none of that. That's for the stolen items, right? Stolen bodies down there beating me up in Georgia. This cop grabs this dude's arm and snatches a bag from his hand to check the receipt. When the cop figures out he didn't steal anything, he has the audacity to give a fake apology. I got drunk, yes sir. Show me. You got it in your hand, sir. He grabbed me, he, he, he held me against my will. He said I grabbed something, I got my Macy bag and my receipt. I will be coming to the lawyer. He detained me. And I got it on film. I don't want any problem, but I have to take this. Okay, Don, I don't know. For I don't know why he did me like this. I'm scared. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, he's got he's got a receipt right now. He grabbed me by my arm. I'm just shopping. Seven forty. Yeah, he's got it. You shouldn't have did me like that. Okay, I'm going to I'll my go lawyer and look in the fitting room, but he definitely is good to go. Sir, you have my deepest apology. It's not gonna be that simple, sir, here, but, but okay. Right here. Major Meckler, M E C A G. You see how they act? You see how they act? But it's all good. Thank you, God. We're gonna get them. This manager gets all upset when a customer takes off his shoe in the store and lies on his sofa. He doesn't like it one bit, so he calls the cops on it and then argues with the customer about it. Frankly, them, because you have to call the cops on me. When you came in yeah. and the door slammed, that was that was not your fault. That was, that was just the door. The door so sticky. the door slammed. Let me finish. Okay. The door was sticky. That's fine. Okay. But when you try and see things from my point of view, you come in and everything else aside, you come in, you take off your, your shoes, you lay down. I can't lay down? I'm a customer of AT&T. There's a reason why they have a freaking sofa down there, okay? But pretty much so the customers can feel re relaxed. This is the reason why the store is here. You understand that? I'm a customer here, okay? I if I want to take off my slippers and relax, you don't have any right to call the cops on me. Okay, I understand. I and that's definitely something I could do. I'm not doing anything wrong. Okay. So what? So that's pretty much why you call the cops on because I was I took off my slippers and I was just relaxing. That's why you call. I was speaking to customer service. And AT and T wearing as well. Why did you have to call the cops? Why? Because did you, I was scared. Okay. I because I'm black. No, not because you're black. Because I'm black. That's no, the only no. reason. What else? What? There's no other reason for you to call the cops on me. Because I'm black. No. Well, what else? There's no other reason. For you to call the cops on me. You were acting erratically. How was that acting erratically? You couldn't tell because I slammed the door or I, I I took off my slippers? That's the reason I was acting erratic? Considering how what people are what people are usually like around here, yeah. 
This male Karen walks in the store with a dog unleashed, and when a worker complains to him about it, he has the audacity to stay there, arguing with them and refusing to leave. You're on the phone with the police? You cannot bring them in the store without a leash on. Yes, I can. No, you cannot. So you have to please leave the store, I said. Please. please leave. Please. Are they coming? They're coming right outside. Please That's fine. leave. I only Bye. Can I just get my drink and then no, I go? No, you cannot. Please. We cannot sell you like this. I'm Why? We cannot sell you. We don't want to listen, so we don't want to sell you. That's it. Why? Because I'm not sell you. No, you okay. don't. I have. No, only... Yes. Only for not not, not, be, not if I'm disabled. No, you cannot. That's like saying it because I'm black. And we told you. No, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. It's like saying this like this is a whites only store. Do you understand? No, it's a whites. You do not have the right. You're you're trying to tell me that because I'm disabled. Like if I came in in a wheelchair. I have a customer piece. Go outside, please. If I came in in a wheelchair, would That's you refuse? You no, it's the same thing. No, because a guy in a wheelchair can't no. walk, right? Listen, a guy, Rashid, you're the owner, man. Can I speak with you? Can I speak with you? You and me are gonna. I said come outside with the dog. Listen, we can talk now, or we can talk. We can talk in court for a long time. Do you want to talk? You gonna come outside with me? Okay, go outside. Take your I'm coming. I'll come out with you. Out here without a vest on. They are not legally, they're not registered as service. Stop. I'll wait for the cops. No, talk to me. No, I will not talk to you. Well, you're going to talk to me in court. No, you're going to talk to me in court. For a long time. For a long time. For like six months, for like three years, five years. We don't care. We don't care. No, you will care. Their dogs are not registered as service dogs because they don't have a service dog vest on. If I'm, I know. If I I'm lying about that, dog. then I pay a hundred dollar fine. You'll pay a five thousand dollar fine, but we're but, not no, going to get one hundred dollars. Oh yes, you will. Wants to be in yes, store. you will. Go ahead. You're going to get fine. Take us to court. I'm going to. Your dogs don't have a service dog. I'm going to take on. you to court. So go right ahead. We I'm don't going care. to take Goodbye, you to court. Goodbye, sir. Goodbye. I'm going to take you to Goodbye. court. Goodbye. I'm waiting for Goodbye. the police. Goodbye. Did you call them or no? The lady says she gave twenty dollars for her order, but the worker insists she didn't and calls the cops on her. After checking the footage, turns out she did give $20. So the workers give her back the 20 with a fake apology. So I'm at Dunkin' Donuts. I came in here with 50, no, I came in here with $72. My daughter had $5, I gave her seven, she lost two on the street. So I gave her my extra dollar to get her lunch, have the change right here. I gave a young lady that works here $20. When it comes time to clear my bill out or give me my change, the young lady's telling me I did not give her any money, okay? And I need my change to do stuff with. That is why I came outside specifically with $70. Because I have something that cost $55 I plan on getting. And the rest was gonna be my change, my little spending money for the week. I'm a hardworking woman. Yes, I just got paid, but I got bills. That is what my paycheck is for, bills. This is a Dunkin' Donuts here. That's their address, that's the young lady. Can you give me a second? I can't hear Yes, that's fine. They're trying to rectify it now. I mean, they're trying to go back and look on cameras now. The way I'm to understand this, is this your daughter? Yeah. Okay. She ordered, she placed the order. Mm -hmm. That transaction was done, change was given back to her, and then you decided to place a second order subsequent to the first? And gave her the $20. Correct. And that's where you, you're saying you gave her the $20? Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, that's where the discrepancy is coming. Exactly. You're saying that no money ever hit the counter, so. That's not correct. I put the money I'm right there. You where I'm and she took it off with. That's all. Okay. I know what she would have said. She's going to, she's going to, yeah. I guess they're looking at it now. Okay. She's on the phone with the corporate. Okay. Try to figure it out. Okay. And now he's coming back. The Schlegel was free. I'm very sorry about that. Thank you. Sorry for the, you know. What exactly? Sorry, sir. What exactly? What exactly happened though? Like, why was I just returned my twenty dollars? Moment, like Please almost a half an hour. Okay, no problem. And I'm very sorry. I'm okay. Whatever you did have, don't worry about it. No, but what I'm saying is, what? It was seen. It it's an in-house thing. Listen, you have your twenty. It is an in-house thing. Just go. I wow. Apologize. That's it. Please go. Okay. I'm very sorry for the end. Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank it's you. And I appreciate you, sirs. Thank you for doing the right thing. Thank you. This lady spots Karen harassing the woman in the store about the way she dresses, 
So she steps in and puts Karen in her place. Don't have so anybody I'm telling you. He has I, his and I, I already had that conversation. Out. That's all I already had that conversation. I can report you. you. I, 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 I'm acting like a fool. You need to the walk away. It's okay with him. for his underwear to be hanging out. I don't know what you're talking about, but you're disrupting already. everybody's service here. Have a good Get day. the f out. Get the f out. I said it. I don't work here. I'm not afraid of you. Get the f out. I'm not afraid of you either. Get the f out. He has their underwear hanging out. It's disrespectful. Do you want me to show the police when they show up? Because I'll show them this video. Because leave that, Karen. Leave. It's actually against the law. Leave Did Karen. You know leave. It's against the law. Okay, leave. leave for somebody leave. to have leave. their leave. underwear hanging out. Leave. It's okay. I'm not an employee. I'm not a afraid of you. Leave. You stupid. Oh. This barefoot Karen thinks she's a tough cookie and harasses a guy at the station. And get this. When her friends bought someone recording the whole crazy scene, they both actually threatened them. And me like I'm a full grown I'm a full grown now. I'm a full grown I'll be scared too. You wanna come up to me like I'm a full grown man. So I'm saying that here in your face. I'm scared. I'll be scared too. I'll be scared too. Get off your fing phone. Who the f you think you're recording? Don't touch me again. I'm scared. Don't touch my phone. Who you recording? Touch my friend and see what the Happens. Who you recorded? Why are you recording me? I don't know Stay you. I don't know you. You come do not on. have permission come to on. record me. Come on. come on. Well, I'm doing it. I'm oh, scared. you're doing it. You're yeah. doing it. I'm scared. See when the I pull up with some to see what the y'all do then. Some what? Some bitch. I cast me out. Are you gonna cast me outside? You gonna see what the N word means in a couple of five minutes, bitch. Are you gonna I didn't you say crazy? nothing to y'all. I didn't say nothing to y'all. Why do you have a dollar bill in your bra? Can get the Why is there a dollar bill in your top? A dollar bill? Don't yeah. you need it? You that broke that you had to walk to the store to get a dollar bill off me? You that broke? You need a dollar bill? I'm racist. I'm racist. Delina, I'm racist. I'm racist. No one says that. I don't know nothing about black Shut the f up. Take your little shrinkly ass shrimp white dick on the f somewhere. Why do you keep talking? Take your little shrimp white dick off somewhere. Don't know nothing about black. Come on. I'm racist. F you on her name. Why are you like this? 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 Why are you like the hotel staff did his best to sort out a room cleaning issue and also apologized to Karen, but she just kept pushing his buttons, refusing to let it go. Resolve the issue. I'm going to get to the bottom of this and resolve the issue for you and your family. I want you to be the happiest you can so you hear. You say you're going to see what I'm going to do. Yes. I'm leaving to go do that because I want your family to be happy. Okay, so then you don't have here. to act that strange with me when I'm asking you to leave this till you resolve it. And I'm saying again, I'm not acting strange with you. Once you said this wasn't yours and this garbage. I know, I but I just want you to leave it here. Till you resolve it, right? And then take the garbage. So then I work for you is what I'm no, saying. You, I, I work for the hotel. You said this I is garbage you. and it's not yours. I know, but I'm there's a lot of garbage here, sir. If you take all the garbage, I'm going to be okay with it. But if you're taking the can that was left in the room and the room was not cleaned properly, I want you to leave this can here and take it when you resolve the issue. This is a resolved issue, right? You said this was garbage and I'm taking out a resolved issue so right this now. Is, this is a resolved issue? This is how you resolve no, issues? This is like you I'm leave the garbage here. Resolve. You leave the garbage here when I check into the room. What garbage? This garbage. You, you, okay, I'm taking the garbage out. Yes, no, no, you don't take the garbage out just like that. You should have kept the room clean. My logic is that if this was left in my room, I don't know if the sheets are clean, I don't know if the towels were clean, or they just look spotless and they were not clean. And I'm going to resolve that issue for you. So why don't you just leave this here, resolve See, listen, it? I'm, I'm going to leave the can here. Okay. For one. For two, if you tell me that you need me to resolve something and I'm trying to, now you're stopping me from resolving the issue that... I don't think you need to take the can to resolve the issue. It's a start. This is a start. You said this was garbage and it wasn't yours. So I'm, t I'm removing it from... The, for the room, because you say it's not nobody in your family. And this is, this is your resolving the issue? No, it's the start. And I'm going to come back 
as a worker here and finish on the resolving the issue that's going to make your family happy. I'm not here. There's not an argument or debate. I'm here to make you guys happy. I'm here to resolve all the issues. You say your carpet was dirty. I mean, why? You say your sheets, you might not be dirty. I'm going to take care of all of that for you and your family to make the so rest you, of your stay So you, I here. have to make four phone calls and come down twice to the front desk in order to get an issue a resolve of this garbage being there and all you do to resolve the issue is pick up the garbage and just leave uh, well, so I, that i mean if i want to really report about this i really cannot well you, you can because i'm here i'm not going to lie about you well you're you here because i called i only excuse the me. fifth time excuse me and i'll say it again i came to work at three o'clock i was not here this morning i'm talking I about have, the hotel you I work have, for the hotel right have, i'm talking right. about the hotel this morning i was not at work i'm here now trying to resolve issue. I can't resolve a morning issue if I wasn't here this morning. I'm trying to make your family... So basically, when somebody checks into your hotel, uh, if they have an issue in the morning, they have to wait till no, 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 people no. check in like at work. No, they do not. That's why I apologize for whatever didn't happen. The workers got Karen's coffee at the drive-thru, just waiting for her to grab her order. But Karen's too busy digging in her purse, not bothering to grab it. Are you a drink carrier? Take the f drink carrier. She's had her hands out there for so Long. Her old head's out the f window. You gotta be f dude. I would have taken them and put them back on the counter by now. This dude, are you f serious this right is why now? I hate working in customer service. Same. This video should not be this long. People like this. What could you possibly be doing? She's still digging around in her bag for sh Oh my god, lady. You could have at least taken the drinks and pulled forward. Dude, she just took her arm out extendo. Hell no. Can you leave, lady? Thank oh you. Oh my God. Gosh. Thank you. Bye. This Karen is causing a scene in the restaurant, yelling for a refund and cussing out the workers. All of this is happening with her poor daughter witnessing the whole thing. 76 Give cents. me my change. Yes, ma'am. It's $11. Will me back. Give me and my change. Yes, ma'am. It's eleven seventy six. Why are you videoing something? Get my change. Cause video whatever you want to video. Give me my damn change. Mm -hmm. We will not be back to this restaurant. Do y'all know how many times we have been to this restaurant and to be insulted by this man about a soda in a cup? We will not be back. Sorry, ma'am. Nobody got no Facebook or Twitter. No one will be back. We will not be back in this restaurant. You go crazy about a like I don't want to pay you. Let me show you how much money I have in my purse, bitch. If I have to pay, bitch, I can pay you for a drink, you fucking Okay. Have a nice Got day. Got a $2 drink. Thank you. To ever try me because I'm black? You think you can try me about a soda because I'm black? Okay. They got $3 to get you for a fucking all the motherfucker. Keep all that shit. Have a nice day. This Karen in the restaurant thought she could harass a worker because they couldn't understand properly on the headset. But guess what? The worker didn't take any of the nonsense and put Karen in her place. Why was she talking to me? Is that how you talk to customers? No, I was trying to explain to the lady I couldn't hear her. No, that's not what. When she said no coke, with small coke and no money. She was trying to tell you. She was trying to talk to you, mm -hmm. and I see that you have a problem talking to her. No, I don't have a problem talking to nobody. You were having you a, have a good day. Leave my restaurant. I was not having a bad day until you came in and started yelling uh -huh. at me. And all I told the lady on the headset is that I didn't understand what she said. She well, that's the lady who went in the car. So I'm asking her, did she? I couldn't hear what she said of the suffering. And now then please leave my said? restaurant. Because you don't have no right coming in here yelling at me. No, you don't have no right calling me. Right? You, you don't have no right to. You came in here yelling at me. Oh, I came in here yelling out. at you. So please leave my establishment oh, now. My you go okay. sit down when you're in the ring now. Go there, sit down. Whoa, so what? I am right alone. She's only 13 years old. Leave my restaurant. Okay. She's a 13 year old. Actually, I'm 14. You have a yeah. fucking problem? 